，就确实消费比以前少一些。现在老百姓。Country Garden, China's largest surviving developer, sinks into debt crisis. The grace period on that principal amount,、um, and before that, you know, people are expecting to see any other ways the Country Garden can raise funds through the offshore channel, whether it's through maybe the loan market or maybe the equity market. Again, even onshore, Country Garden sold a government guaranteed bond last year in the local market. In a dramatic turn of events, Country Garden Holdings, China's once celebrated property titan, has stumbled into the treacherous terrain of financial turmoil. The echoes of missed interest payments on not one, but two U.S. dollar bonds have sent shockwaves reverberating throughout the labyrinthine landscape of the nation's real estate industry. Once held aloft as a paragon of success by Chinese authorities, this 31-year-old developer's fall from grace is sending ripples of apprehension through an already volatile market. Worried investors have already been protesting. They want to be repaid money owed by ailing Chinese property giant.、Ever、the implications of Country Garden's descent into a debt crisis are profound and far-reaching. As the largest surviving developer in China, its financial quagmire underscores the fragility that now pervades the once soaring real estate sector. What was once hailed as a beacon of prosperity and progress has morphed into a cautionary tale, casting an ominous shadow over the industry that once seemed impervious to downturns. The timing of this debacle is particularly poignant, as China's real estate market is grappling with a multitude of challenges. Regulatory reforms aimed at curbing speculative excesses have reshaped the landscape, altering the dynamics that players like Country Garden had long thrived within. With the specter of tightened regulations looming large, many are now witnessing a paradigm shift in the way business is conducted. The missed payments have triggered a cascade of repercussions, felt not only by investors but by the broader economy as well. As Country Garden's U.S. dollar bonds plummet, the aftershocks are felt across financial markets, inducing a sense of unease that knows no boundaries. Investors, both domestic and international, are left grappling with the implications of a developer once deemed too big to fail stumbling on such a public stage. The fate of Country Garden serves as a sobering reminder that the veneer of success can often belie underlying vulnerabilities. The sprawling housing complexes and gleaming skyscrapers that dot China's urban landscapes have been emblematic of the nation's remarkable rise on the global stage. Yet beneath the shimmering surface, the stark realities of unsustainable debt burdens and overleveraged balance sheets have been building, waiting for the right trigger to expose them. As financial analysts and pundits dissect the nuances of Country Garden's predicament, questions abound: Will this stumble herald a wider reckoning for China's property sector, or is it an isolated event? Are there systemic issues lurking within the industry that have yet to reveal themselves fully, and what role will the government play in either alleviating or exacerbating the crisis? As the dust settles on Country Garden's missed payments, a sense of caution blankets the once buoyant atmosphere that characterised the property development sphere. Lessons are to be learned from this humbling episode, ones that extend beyond China's borders. In an era where economic interconnectivity knows no bounds, the fate of a single developer can send shockwaves far beyond its own shores. In the intricate dance between ambition and financial prudence, Country Garden stumble serves as a stark reminder that no player, no matter how illustrious, is immune to the unpredictable currents of the global economy. The sprawling skylines that once seemed invincible now stand as testament to the perils of overreach. Whether this serves as a harbinger of deeper crises or a catalyst for introspection remains to be seen. But one thing is clear: the trajectory of China's real estate has taken an unforeseen turn, and the world is watching with bated breath.